Thanks for joining us here at five, everybody. A robbery caught on camera. Now this business, the latest victim of smash and grabs. Valid kicks in Southeast Memphis robbed Sunday by dozens of people at one time. Our Brittany Moncrease is live at the sneaker store where owners are dealing with the aftermath. Brittany. That's right, a total mess, but not a total loss. After being robbed of almost everything, Valley Kicks is resilient. When all else fails, you stay true to you. I just wanted to bring something culturally to this area. Keith Cannon is part owner of Valid Kicks and Brandon Henderson, a manager. We stay valid by doing right by people. Even when people are wrong. Sunday evening after closing, Valid Kicks was robbed. I got an alert to my phone. I watched some 25 people come through that, that window right there. One after the other in at least 10 cars, grabbing any and everything. That door in particular is a steel door. They knew they couldn't get through there. They went around to the back and knocked through the wall to get through that door. And to go through those lengths, those measures, just to get some sneakers is crazy. I, I don't even have any words for it. Speechless, not just for the business itself, but one that gives back to the community. Everybody know that I help anybody, so it's no point to steal from me at all. We got program J's for A's. If you get bullied at school, if, if you get good grades, you can come in here and get a free pair of shoes. Valley Kicks was also hosting a holiday toy drive for less fortunate kids. All the toys, gone. They stole from them too. Manager Brianna Brooks says since the store opened in March, it's been robbed not once, not twice, but four times. Another break in last month that we're still dealing with, we haven't even wrapped that up yet. Yeah. We're a local business. We're giving back. Why, you know, why us? And though many questions, Valley Kicks still has one answer. Although it happened in the community, it doesn't affect how we react and show love to one another. I can't let them see me defeated. I'm not going to let it stop me. It's still people that need me for motivation. Valid and true, no matter what. And Keith said they do plan to rebuild, but most likely in a different location. They'll also continue their holiday toy drive and have started a GoFundMe for support. In Southeast Memphis, I'm Brittany Moncrease.